So far, in the beginning, I wasn't really enjoying it anyway, because it delayed my education. But on the other hand, I would say it's pay off anyway, because I got to do a lot of things. Like I learned how to do a bit of fashion designing. I learned bead making and some other interior decors too. And so many other things anyway. So I would say, due to this strike, I've been able to gain those knowledge. Like they say, no knowledge is lost. So. Academically, what would you say? Academically. Do. Honestly, I, w I wasn't able to read that much because of the other things that I had to do. So I had just little time for studies. For the final year students, most of them were able to um, round up their projects easily. And like the pressure they would have had running the school and also writing projects. I also know of some um, departments which would have gone for um, um, teaching practice like education. Uh, faculty, sorry, and also some department, like I said, that will go on field work and also attend classes. So most people use that as, a, as an opportunity to have their field work being concluded, like mass come and the rest. And some um, were able to do one or two things. The strike affected most of our lectures because our lectures has to be sandwiched for now. If I we, although our lecturers they resumed anyway, but you know, at his, as the lecture is supposed to be, that is not how it is for now. I have to leave my book for some time because you need to get yourself acquitted to certain things. You need to have get some skill acquisition in order for you to meet up with due to the strike. So it affected me academ um, academically because I could not be able to do those or remember those things I have done for some time. So now coming to the campus is now trying to do a lot of things which I'm supposed to have done due to the strike. At the beginning of the strike, I was reading my books thinking that the, as usual they'll just use maybe one month. But it was like things were not going on well. So I started losing interest in my books. I couldn't read my books again. The times I would just open it and I would just be staring at it. And when you, when you keep hearing on the news that we and that see if two people are currently nobody's ready to you get that kind of thing. So there was no motivation to read again. At first I was supporting the lecturers but later it was it was getting you know his education now is a very important it's a very important sector. They shouldn't take it, they should have not taken it too long. It was as if they were trying to prove who is better. I supported the lecturers because they were not just fighting for themselves. It was for our own good. Then the government, they were also trying to say they don't, they're trying to cover up for themselves. But it was getting too long and as I said, they didn't even care again. Most of us, when we were in school, you know, some people, we are still even pushing them to learn. But look at the gap, six months at home. We just have to cover up and just three weeks for us to revise and get ready for exam. If you look at it, it's going to be, I, I can say it authoritatively that it's going to affect a lot of results. Surely it has um, so many um, effects on the student. It all depends on individual as well. So I decided to go into um, IT, uh, that is um, information technology, try to learn one or two things. Some decided to go into web development, some um, 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 networking and whatnot. And some are using that uh, time as well to like, um, maybe if you're in year three right now, your um, their seminar, putting things together, stuff like that. And some, it all depends on, as I said, it all depends on the individual. Uh, during the strike, I spent two months at home doing nothing. So I, after August, then I had a plan to go and learn fashion designing. Then just staying at home because after school it will help me even if I don't use my education. Auto, um, should I say it? Okay, on both sides though, it was a gain and also a loss. On the other side, for us not being in school, I'm sure we missed lots of things that we should have actually covered up. And on the other side, I actually acquired lots. At least for the period of five months, I was able to work for those period and I gained a lot. A lot of people, you know, uh, uh, did not uh, maximize the opportunity for doing something positive. Most, I can say, it was just I do doing nothing and just roaming about the streets. Some again themselves in gambling, some smoking and some other stuff. 
But one thing is just that the gap between um, the academic calendar is the most um, annoying thing out of this whole thing. Like now, some of us should be concluding, some should be um, going to final year at this time of the day. But we just find ourselves still repeating um, last semester work. Yeah, different things have happened during the strike. I've been hearing from the hostel, maybe the nearby door now. Like three people are already married, one is pregnant. My department, I hear of different things. If it's not pregnancy, it's marriage. If it's not marriage, it's introduction. I saw some of my classmates coming back with pregnancy. <laughs> anyway, most some of them got married. Um, just married. I've not seen any with pregnancy. Anyway.